Life is like an elevator. Everyone starts life on the ground floor. Everyone starts from the bottom. Everyone starts from nothing. By luck, some are born in golden elevators, while others in steel or iron. We all start from the bottom, so the only direction where we can go from the bottom is up. And up we go, up to floors where we have not been before. The first floors we travel with our parents, the ones closest to us. They are the ones that press the elevator buttons and decide where we go. The first floor offers the greatest surprise and the greatest adventure. With childhood innocence, we look at the world with amazement for the first time and the only thing we want to do is play. As kids, we want to play with toys. On the first floor of the elevator of life, life is just pure joy. But at some point, we go back to the elevator and we move to the next floor. On the next floors, we learn what is an elevator, what is life, but also most importantly, we learn how to operate the elevator for ourselves. These are the years and the floors where we get educated away out of our ignorance and we gain knowledge from people that have been in the elevator before. Other people who have been in the same elevator have shared some wisdom about what might hide on the higher floors. Once we have learned enough to satiate our curiosity, we move to the next floor. On the next floor, we work to improve the elevator for ourselves and others. Once we graduate from school, we aim to find a job in order to make the elevator faster, more resilient, more beautiful than when we started our journey. The more we work, the better our elevator becomes. Through our work, the elevator will improve so much that at some point we decide to take others with us on the same journey. We meet partners, friends, family, and we decide to explore the higher floors together. As we go higher and higher on the elevator of life, we notice that we gain more and more freedom to choose our elevation. As we explore every ascending floor, we notice that it's up to us how high we want to go. It is up to us how much we want to explore and contribute to life on each floor. But we also notice that the elevator only goes up and never down. The decisions that we make follow us on every floor, but we can never go back and reverse our decisions. On the last floors, once we have worked hard our whole lives, we find our retirement. If we have worked hard, we have perfected our elevator and instead of serving the elevator, the elevator becomes our servant. We finally find the joy that we experienced when we were kids, but this time, instead of being ignorant of the elevator, we have become the master of it. We have lived and explored all the floors with the elevator called life. Finally at the end, we get to the top. We get to the highest floor and we are filled with wonder about the beauty that hides there. As the door opens, we are enveloped in light. The light blinds us to the anticipation of what hides behind it. But to our greatest surprise, there is absolutely nothing on the top floor. Nothing but the experience that we've gained while riding the elevator of life. That is the greatest secret of the elevator. And we can only become aware of this secret when we get to the top. That is the biggest secret of life. One which we can only learn through our living. We have to go through every floor to get to the top. And once we get to the top, once we get from life everything that we truly desired, our final desire is to go back to the beginning.